It's going to be wall to wall for today. It's going to be a nice one too. We're at 79 degrees currently. The dew point's fairly comfortable at 61. Uh, therefore, it feels like 80, so not much of a heat index to deal with as well. And winds from the west at 12 miles per hour. So all in all, it's the stage for a nice uh, day today into the day tomorrow too. But the humidity is going to crank up a touch tomorrow, and that's the big difference. A few of our sensors are not reporting, but the ones that are, are showing the 80s. Mount Clemens, winds are at 81. Also out towards Ann Arbor at around 77 degrees and down towards Adrian at 80 as well. Zooming out, showing you the perspective here. This is our next system that we're tracking. But before we address that one, here's what's left of... Uh, hurricane or now tropical depression Henri that's going to continue to push off towards the east. The same system that's going to help kick that out is actually right here. Uh, this is going to lift a warm front into Metro Detroit though, so it's already hot. So when you add a warm front to this, it lets you know it only gets hotter from here. The humidity will crank up and so will the heat as well. A few of those showers and storms along this cold front. That's something we're going to follow. The models are not handling it very well, but I still think there's a chance of seeing some showers and storms tomorrow. Uh, lots of sunshine on tap today. Mid to upper 80s is what we're expecting. A pretty nice evening too. I'm thinking numbers will dip down to the upper 70s for tonight. Lower humidity is going to allow us to cool down at least a touch in some spots. We'll be near 68 in Detroit, 67 in Mount Clemens. Notice that rain trying to move in out to the west, thinking it holds off initially, but once we get towards the afternoon, that chance of rain will be there. I'm not thinking it'll be totally widespread, but if we miss out on the rainfall, notice the heat. It could definitely heat up in a hurry for your Tuesday. Going with the high temp of 90 degrees, and that's almost a guarantee if you dodge the showers and the storms passing through. Uh, going into the evening, storms will still be possible, and with the humidity spiking, really it's an active seven-day forecast here. From Tuesday all the way on through the weekend, we'll have at least a chance of seeing some showers and storms. Highs in the 90s for Tuesday and Wednesday, and even when we cool down, it's not much. In the upper 80s is where we'll be for the rest of the week. The news continues after this.